welcome to the Richland County School District One Honor Orchestra. I'm gonna pretend like I know what I'm doing. I don't, there we go. I am Brian McCants, and I am the lead orchestra teacher for Richland County School District One, and I am the orchestra director at Hand Middle School, and I have been doing this job for 23 years and absolutely love teaching orchestra in Richland One. You all are in for a great treat tonight as we have prepared some wonderful music for you. Um, to start off with will be the middle school honor orchestra and then our faculty ensemble will play and then we'll finish tonight with the high school group. I really would like everyone to stay for the whole thing and see the progression of our different levels. Um, it will not be a very long concert, so thank you so much for that. If you go ahead and handle any of your loud cell phones, um, just kind of get those down on buzz. Feel free to take as many pictures um, as you want. Try to not have the flash on. We got some wonderfully bright lights on here um, to be able to see everybody. Um, I would like to first thank AC Flora High School and Ms. Susan Childs, the principal, for hosting us here. Um, we have started rotating around the district um, and going to a different high school uh, each year, and it was AC Flora's turn again, and we were very happy uh, to be here. I'd like to also thank our coordinator of uh, visual and performing arts, Mr. Walter Graham. If you're here in the house, we get a little house lights on for a little bit. I'm gonna introduce some people. Where's Mr. Graham? Oh, in the back, okay. Hey, Walter. Um, are there any, I'd like to also keep the house lights on for just a little bit. Are there any uh, district employees, teachers, administrators, district, district office staff, if you would please raise your hands and let us know that you're here supporting us tonight. You might need to turn around. They might be sitting back there in the back. Thank you so much. Some of you might have both roles as an orchestra parent and a district employee, and we certainly love that. Um, and we'd also like to thank um, all of the um, help that we've had here, the band director, Mr. Sweat, uh, Ms. Dallas, the uh, coordinator for the fine arts department, and our custodial staff here. They've been absolutely amazing. I'm hoping that our teachers can hear me and we'll walk on out. Uh, we'll start with Dr. Alvoy Bryan from uh, some elementary schools in Richland One, if you'll make your way out here. And we'll hold our applause to the end. I got quite a list on, oh, thank you. Mr. Domain Cunningham is at C.A. Johnson High. Ms. Jennifer Dudkenton is at Alcorn Middle and Elementary Schools. Dr. Constance G is at St. Andrews Middle and Columbia High. Ms. Jessica Hankin is at Elementary Schools. Ms. Dottie Hanlon is at Elementary Schools. Mr. Tyler Henderson is at Gibbs Middle and Eau Claire High School. Ms. Kara Hickman is at Hopkins and Southeast Middle. Ms. Christy Lewis is at W.J. Keenan High and W.G. Sanders Middle. Ms. Cheryl Monroe is at elementary schools. Mr. William Murphy is at Lower Richland High School. Uh, Ms. Catherine Pollock is at Creighton. Unfortunately, she uh, could not be with us tonight. She had a situation that she had to go deal with, but we'll definitely shout her out. Mr. Alejandro Salgado is at elementary schools. Ms. <laughs> Ms. Sarah Steves is at W.A. Perry Middle. Mr. Nathan Tucker is at Dreer High in an elementary school. And it's Really amazing moment for me tonight um, as I introduce one of my former students who is now the orchestra director here at AC Flora High School, Mr. Jarvanique Tinsley. And this is an absolutely amazing staff. I'm going to run my mouth a little bit while y'all go on back. So thank you so much for coming out here. Some of them knew they were coming out here, not everybody. Um, I'll move now to introducing our middle school conductor for the evening. This is Dr. Janine Parnell, who is the orchestra director at Spring Valley High School here in Columbia. She's a violinist and violist, performed professionally all around, and does an absolutely amazing job with her students and with our students here. This is Dr. Janine Parnell, and this is the middle school Richland One Honor Orchestra.
They're wonderful kids. I hope it's all right. I call them kids. That's what I call mine at Spring Valley. They're smart and talented. They're funny. They've been very cooperative these few hours we've been together. And uh, I really do appreciate the opportunity to work with them. For our final piece, um, Shay, what is your last name? Johnson. Johnson? Johnson. Johnson. Um, we will be accompanied, assisted by Shay Jones on percussion. Let's give her a hand. Our final piece is a Dua Lipa Dua. We thank you for your kind attention. Dr. Parnell, I'm going to interrupt you one more time. On behalf of Richland One for outstanding conducting and musical direction for the 2023 Richland One Honor Orchestra, we have this plaque for you, and I'll give it to you as soon as we get off stage. Or actually, I can give it to you now if you'd like. Go ahead and take it. Okay, you're welcome. Thank you. And I will put out another plug uh, for Shayla Jones because she was in the same class as Jarvanique, another one of my former students. I'm like DJ Khaled up here and another one and another one because Domaine Cunningham, who's also at C.A. Johnson, was in that very same class. So I'm very happy they'll be here. Here's a Dua Lipa Dua.
we could have the house lights on just a little bit while our middle school students make their way down to their seats. Parents, I really want them to stay and hear our faculty perform and the high school uh, perform. So if you've got another half hour in you, we'd really appreciate it. Middle school students, if you'll start making your way down here to these front rows, cello basses, you can put your instruments back there. Violins and violas, go ahead and take them with you and leave the folders on the stand. Leave the folders on the stand. All right, hopefully your paper looks a little better than mine that just went in my pocket, but if I can get you all to find this piece of paper right here that has all of our high achieving orchestra students uh, for this school year. I'll start with the 2022 Richland One Midlands Region Orchestra. So Region is Richland One, Richland Two, Lexington Reach Five, Lexington One, Lexington Two, Aiken, um, and I think Fairfield counties. So we had 33 students make it from Richland One this year. That was an amazing feat. Uh, students from Hand, Creighton, St. Andrews, Dreer, Columbia High, AC Flora High, um, and Eau Claire High School. So if you were a Richland One Midlands Region Orchestra student, please stand right now. I'm not gonna read all 33 names, but you can see them. Go ahead and stand, Region students. And our friends down in Aiken were always traveling up here for these Richland's event, Richland region events, excuse me, uh, to Richland County or Lexington County, and they uh, were able to host at USC Aiken this year. So it was our first time driving down there, um, and we'll be back there next year. So if you did not make region this year, we certainly encourage you to work with your teacher and get that region music so this list can be even longer next year. Um, this past weekend, we went down to Cane Bay High School, and that's down in Somerville in Berkeley County, and we had students make the South Carolina All-State Orchestra. So if you made All-State Orchestra, please stand. And all of these students were incredible, but I am gonna give an extra special shout out to Xavion Boy Gray, who is my knowledge, and I've been around a long time, my hair's a lot grayer, Shayla told me, um, since she saw me, that he is the first student from St. Andrews Middle School to make All-State Orchestra, so we are very proud of that achievement tonight. And finally, back in November, I was very, very privileged to be able to go to National Harbor, which is right outside of D.C., um, for our two students from Dreer that made the all-national honor orchestra and performed with students all over the country. And that was Sammy Schatz and Daniel Rose. And I think Daniel just had a wonderful adventure. Is he back in the room? Daniel, good to see you. Will you and Sam please stand up? highlight of their trip was not the amazing concert of music that they played. The highlight was going to McDonald's on Saturday night. Yep, they know it. Um, so hopefully I stalled long enough for my colleagues to make their way out. Yep, they're doing that now. Uh, you are in for a treat. Um, one, you get to look at an amazing mistake I made on the program. I called it the Gross Concerto. It is actually the Concerto Grosso. Uh, which is Italian for the grand or great concerto. And that was picked by our wonderful colleague, Mr. Salgado, who has been very, very helpful getting this piece ready tonight. So we're gonna play two movements, and I'll give you a hint. You don't clap in between the two movements. You just kind of wait till we stand. And I have to get my cello, so bear with me one second.
And if we'll just turn the house lights on while our high school students make their way up. Violins and violas, if you'll come this way, please, and cello bass, go get your instruments safely from over there and make your way up. Pause for the cause for a quick transition. <laughs> I know it's been a minute since you've seen me, but I'm, I'm stalling again. Oh, I mean, I'm informing you of important things that are going on. Um, I hope you could see uh, the just incredible passion and talent that our uh, teachers have um, for their instruments. Um, I really enjoyed uh, playing that piece. I had not played that one since high school, and it was uh, great to get back together with everybody um, because we are still uh, professional musicians um, that teach uh, here in Richland One um, in our classroom. So we were very excited to be able to put that together for you. Um, next up is our high school group. They've been working very hard. Um, under the direction of Ms. Sarah Smitherman, uh, who is the sister of uh, Ms. Amy Evers, who used to teach here in Richland 1 and is now over um, in Richland 2 with Dr. Parnell. Um, but we are so happy uh, that she is here leading this group and also very proud of our concert mistress tonight, Ms. Juliette Swaim, uh, who's on her way out to tune the orchestra.
It's so awesome to hear a bass solo in our orchestra. Let's give her another round of applause for the great work on that bass. And Juliet, your solo sounded amazing too. I didn't want to leave you out. I'd like to present this to Sarah Smitherman for outstanding conducting and musical direction for the Richmond One High School Honor Orchestra. We'll present you this plaque. We'll pose. And I'll take that from you. Okay. So I was going to say a quick little word. Thank you so much for having me here. Um, it's my mom taught at Dreer and Han, I don't even know how many years ago, so it's kind of funny that I'm back in the area to do this, so this is really cool. These kids are awesome. They came very well prepared. I really didn't do, have a lot to do, just waved my stick and they did the rest, so I really appreciate them. I appreciate the school hosting us and all the teachers that helped in all the different ways, and thank you all so much for coming out and supporting these awesome kids.
All right. Thank you all so much for coming tonight. Uh, middle schoolers, you need to make sure your instruments get packed up, including the cellos and basses. Your teachers have to get those instruments home. Um, from beyond the thunder and visions of the sky here, I hope that our weather is doing well tomorrow um, and that everybody has a safe, safe drive home and a safe day tomorrow. Make sure you get everything. Make sure you thank your teachers and make sure that the instruments are safe and not lost. Thank you all so much for coming. Y'all have a great evening.